The Inflation Reduction Act uh, will result in a savings uh, for the city of Appleton projected to be almost over $2 million. The original Appleton uh, Public Library was built in 1981 and then renovated in 90, 1995 and hasn't seen any major upgrades since. So one of the goals for the new library was definitely to you know, reduce uh, the carbon footprint and make it as sustainable as we could uh, within the budgets uh, constraints that we're facing. My name is Dean Gaza. I'm the Director of Parks, Recreation and Facilities Management for the City of Appleton. Protecting the environment is e essential. Um, it's, it's who we are. Uh, we need naturally clean water. We need clean air. We need a nice, a good place to live. And it's our job uh, in the city to make sure we, we, everybody's considered and we provide equality for everyone. And this is a big, probably the most essential part of it. Health is something that can't be replaced. Being a library, we look at this as setting an example, and it's a place where people come and actually learn, but also it's kind of like a laboratory, which we're gonna showcase a lot of the library and in, in, in the sustainability efforts. At the library, we're using geothermal, and geothermal is a, a much more cost-effective way of heating and cooling the building, which will save us a lot of money. Every government is really facing budgetary challenges, not only on the operation side, but the capital side. And a lot of these projects um, are either deferred because of inflation recently, uh, or cost of construction and so forth. But the Inflation Reduction Act really took some of those barriers away by giving us incentives to, uh, to continue with the plans that we had in place. Um, the Inflation Reduction Act uh, will result in a savings uh, for the city of Appleton projected to be almost over $2 million. That money will allow us to reinvest and put solar on top of the building. We see uh, what this does to our community. We have a vision and, um, and uh, I think that's why Appleton is an attractive place for people to, to visit and, and to live. I highly encourage the municipalities to go after these green energy credits for the benefit of their constituents, saving money uh, for their taxpayers, um, also providing a cleaner community, providing green jobs, and uh, making a better place for everybody.